Welcome back, everybody, to Escape the Depths, where we have a few things to take note of here. So the armor stand puzzle, where I'm going to be setting these armor stands, depends on which head is above, is below which one of these blocks. So, you know, skeleton needs to go to the sea lantern area, creeper needs to go to the glowstone, I think that's a shroom over the wither, and I'm not sure what that is over the zombie. The other thing, there's a portal back at the last room, which we'll go and take a look here in a second. So there's a portal in the other room, and what levers we flip is going to depend on where the Eyes of Ender are in this map. Or, I'm sorry, in this portal. So let's go take a look at that. So on this one, I believe it's which of the Eyes of Ender weren't in place to activate the end portal. So I think this is it? Or no, I think I got to do the inverse of where the Eyes of Ender were. Hang on. Ah, that got it. That's two of three uh, puzzles done. Oh. Now for the armor stand. Now that I have all the levers, I can actually do this thing. Oh, it was a jack-o'-lantern, so the zombie is the jack-o'-lantern. That makes more sense. Okay, let's do this. Let's rotate everything here. There's the creeper. So the creeper would need to go to the glowstone. So let's rotate this once. Okay, let's turn on the glowstone light for the creeper. The zombie needs to go to the pumpkin. That one I can turn on. My friend the wither needs to go... Actually, I think I can turn all these on. It's going to kick the armor stands all to where they need to go. I hope. Nope, I messed it up real bad. So it flips them to the opposite direction of where they're going. Let's reset here. We did it! That took a second. Okay, I think that's everything I need to do down here. Let's get the hell out of here, man. And look at that. That's a cool piece of architecture right there. I think I need to... Hooray, we did it. Good job, everybody. Let's go! Oh, part five. Wow, leaps of faith. Oh gee, Willikers, it's a parkour puzzle. Respawn. Switch stick. What the hell do those have to do with anything? Ah, crap. Ooh, what's this? Extras. Throw to return to the last checkpoint. Oh, okay. Let's hope I don't need... <laughs> okay, come on. Oh. <laughs> you cheeky dick waffle. Wait. Oh, no. Come on, I was hitting the jump button. map creator ain't messing around, man. At least it doesn't appear like I have to do too many. Oh, right. I kind of whipped that one a little bit. Not a problem, I don't think. Can I save it? Nope, I couldn't save it. All right, once more. All right, once more. <laughs> All right, once more. Okay, the checkpoint. This sucks. Come on. Ooh, big jump. Oh, gee willikers. Oh, golly gosh darn. Oh, shit. 
Well, that's okay. Still saved it. Not a problem. No problems here. None whatsoever. You know, this kind of reminds me of... Oh, I totally had that. This kind of reminds me of Batman Arkham Knight with the some of the Joker... I'm sorry, some of the Riddler puzzles. The car driving things where you had the lane... You had to do, like, the... You had to activate uh, walls and stuff while driving so that your Batmobile didn't crash into things. This puzzle reminds me exactly of that. I didn't like it then. I still don't like it now. <laughs> but that's just a, a personal preference. Oh, okay. I take back some of the things I've said about parkour. That is actually a very cool mechanic. That sort of uh, super jump. I like that. I don't like that I keep dying in lava, though. Jumps are the worst thing to ever come out of parkour. <laughs> no! You rat bastard! Once more! No! I hit a corner. Stop hitting the corner. Ah! Setting in! No! Maximum. Ha! Oh, no. I think we're finally... Oh, thank God. May I leave? Thank you. Let's just keep her moving. That's strange. William said that the warden would be in the nether, but I never saw him. Hm. Well, let's not look a gift horse in the mouth. Let's just leave. I hope that I don't have to fight the... Kidding, more parkour? I hate parkour. Boom. May I leave now? Wait, do I have to piss this thing off really loudly again? Just like in that... What the hell? What do I need to do? I'm just gonna stand really quietly. Haha! -ha! Got him. Block of gold. Oh, it's kind of like a, a rehash of placed on a placed on polished andesite stairs. Oh, I get it. Maybe not. But it's kind of like a rehash of like all the stuff we just did in the map. That's kind of neat. Oh god, are you kidding me? Not more parkour. Onward and upward! Talk to William. Holy shit! I'm not engaging in that. Oh, thank god I've arrived. I'm sure you're wondering about the beast by the stairs. Uh, yeah! It turns out he can't survive in the nether. Right after you went through the portal, the warden fell through the exit portal, already dead. Must have died trying to find a way through. Oh! Cool. Um, imagine the possibilities of having a heightened sense of vibration. They're endless, and I can implement it. Villagers will have much better defense against mobs. Fantastic. Did you bring the, my house key? Once I have it, we can both get out of here. House key? Why the hell is there the house key on my head? I'm done. Well then. I can see my stats. I can see how badly I did. Wow. If 
finally done with Escape the Depths. Well, now that I'm finally done with this game, I suppose I can give some, some thoughts here. Uh, the map, pretty good escape map. Um, I am a fan of puzzles, and this one definitely had some very challenging puzzles that didn't always necessarily make sense on how you were to complete them. There are some pretty big stretches of logic, I think, for a lot of the, for, I would say a good half of these puzzles had huge stretches of logic in order to solve them, but that's okay. Uh, the set dressings were fantastic. The whole premise of the overarching warden threat was kind of a neat idea. And overall, it was a pretty good experience. I would rate the map a solid 7 out of 10. Again, those stretches and logics for the puzzles and the parkour uh, sections did breed a lot of frustration. Once you, your map starts breeding frustration, it kind of moves out of fun and into, well, let's just get this over. So with that, thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.